Now, Action 10 Sonia Hill with your Doppler 10 weather forecast. Howdy, South Texas. Happy Valentine's Day. Well, speeding and wet road conditions added up to trouble for one driver earlier this morning. He was traveling north on Highway 361 around 7 a.m. when his pickup skidded out of control on the Packery Channel Bridge. The truck then slammed into the cement highway divider, spun around and landed on top of the guardrail. The driver and his passenger luckily were not hurt. He was, however, ticketed for failure to control his speed. Police say drivers need to slow down when road conditions are as slippery as they were this morning. So we did see some light rain this morning, but now taking a look at the current radar, plenty of cloud coverage still in place, but we're not seeing any rain at this hour. And taking a look at the highs for today, yesterday pretty mild, but today much warmer. Many of us back into the 70s today here in Corpus Christi. We reached 70 degrees, 69 in Rockport, 69 in Beeville, and 72 degrees in Robstown. But right now in downtown Corpus Christi, mild and very humid. We're sitting at 67 degrees. Winds are light out of the east, and we are seeing overcast skies currently in Corpus Christi. But taking a look at the temperatures across the state of Texas, pretty hard to believe, but some of the communities up near the Panhandle seeing temperatures that are warmer than what we're seeing here in South Texas. Currently in the city, 67 degrees, 78 up in Abilene, 78 also in Lubbock, and 68 degrees in Austin. But here's what we'd expect for the rest of tonight. Foggy once again with mild temperatures. Let's go ahead and take a look at what's going on right now on SPID. Just take a look at that. Traffic flowing nicely, but we're already Already seeing fog developing here in the area. Let's go ahead and take a look at tonight's forecast once again. Expect a low of 62 degrees tonight, and the winds will be on the south southeast up to about 15 miles per hour. Although we're seeing some patchy fog right now, you can expect to see some dense fog later on tonight, so do be aware that visibility will be very poor overnight. But looking ahead at tomorrow, luckily we can expect to see some sunshine finally. Also breezy conditions and warmer temperatures. We'll see a high near 78 degrees tomorrow, and the winds will also be picking up, blowing out of the south southeast up to about 20 miles per hour. Now taking a longer look at our Thursday, 7 a.m., mostly cloudy and mild, 63 degrees by noon, much warmer, mostly sunny, 75 degrees. We'll see some breezy conditions as well and then 5 p.m. still breezy and warm very close to 80 degrees tomorrow 78 degrees well now it's time for a seven day forecast made possible by auto nation auto nation has a car or truck you want at a great price shop now and save at autonation.com now taking a look at the seven day forecast tomorrow partly cloudy and much warmer do expect to see some morning fog Friday, mostly sunny highs near 80 degrees once again, but Friday evening, that's when our next front is going to roll through. And with it, we can see isolated showers. We'll continue to see showers on Saturday and Sunday. Lows will be back into the mid to upper 60s. Monday, warming back up. Expect windy conditions, isolated showers.